What's up YouTube, it's Robo and I'm back with another quick video. This is kind of an interesting little glitch that's been happening in uh, iOS since iOS 9 came out. Uh, it's it's a way that you can speed up the animations on your device. Uh, this will work I think on any device that's on iOS 9, uh, even up to iOS 9.3, the most recent version that just came out. This kind of does what no slow animations does. If you've ever, if you've jailbroken and you've ever used that tweak, it speeds up every animation that is on the device. So the way that you get it to work, this works on every device on iOS 9 up to 9.3. Uh, what, what you do is you go into settings, you scroll down to general, then go down to accessibility, then you have to scroll down to assistive touch and turn that on. So what you want to do after you get the little dot down here, you want to make sure that it's in the bottom right hand corner all the way down to the bottom. And then you click and bring up spotlight and that way the little dot will kind of go up above the keyboard and just tap again and it'll jump back down. And keep doing that a couple times until you see the little dot jump down really quick and then you can see that the animations have been uh, glitched and this, this will still work. It might take you a couple tries, it took me a little while to get the kind of the dot to, to listen and to keep it going. But once you get it working, you'll see that the animation is much faster instead of like this slow, cause you can see here when I open up any app, you can see like a slow fade into the app. That's not what you're looking for. When you get it to work, it's gonna instantly blink into the app. It won't even show in an animation. It'll just immediately open. So you just keep doing this until you see the little dot kind of jump down really quick, much faster than that. Um, and then you'll see that the animation works. So I'm gonna keep doing this until it appears and then I will show you guys what it looks like. So there you go. So now you guys can see that the little dot kind of immediately jumps up and down from the keyboard. So that way you can tell that the animation has, or the little glitch has worked. So when you go to open up an app, it just immediately blinks open. You see that? Just click Safari. Bam, immediately blinks open. So even if you close out of it, close out of everything, it still immediately blinks open. It takes a second to maybe load the extra stuff, but once you have everything in the background in the multitasking bar, it'll immediately open and load exactly what you were doing before. So it's a very simple way to do it. You don't need a jailbreak. This is completely un and stock firmware, uh, iOS 9.3. And this is uh, Saturday, March 26th, 2016. So it still works to this day. Uh, make sure you guys try it out, see what you think. If you hate it, if you, want to if you want to go back to normal, all you have to do is turn the phone off and turn it back on. That's all you have to do. You don't have to restore, you don't have to do anything like that. It'll fix the uh, kind of a glitch and then you'll be right back to normal. And if you ever want to do it again, just go back into settings, turn assistive touch on, and then do that little thing and you'll be good to go. Once you get it working, you can turn off assistive touch. You don't need to have that down there anymore and you can see that it still works perfectly fine open up settings immediately blinks in open up safari immediately blinks in it's much quicker to switch apps as well so if i'm going to go between settings and safari oh, settings and safari you know so it's, it's basically no solo animations without the jailbreak so i hope you guys like this video and i will see you all in the next one thanks guys